people aren't here to hear about Artie having a rough time, and by rough time meaning first world problems at his job and changing into his pajamas. You're here for Hollow Knight, and I'm here for Hollow Knight too. Oh yeah. Back in Dirtmouth, we got some fancy new moves. I want to go back to the fungus area. Because I haven't been there in a while, and I bet you I can do some new stuff there. Freak Snowstorm. <laughs> yes, there's a new sound alert. And you would not believe how long it took me to find a clean rip of that <laughs> from Donkey Kong 64. But there you go. Hey, Simpsons R Us, nice to see ya. My Easter was very nice. Got to spend Easter with my family. Had a great time. We played a lot of Dominion, which is a card game. It's my favorite uh, tabletop game out there. It was awesome. Very fun. Great food. Great people. How was everybody else's Easter? Oh, do I not have the train station open for the fungus area? Oh. Well, I know what we're going to do then. We're going to have to find our way to the open... I, get, I bet you there is one. I just haven't found it. Alright. Uh, the fungal wastes. That's right. Okay, so it's a little bit of a trek, but that's not too bad. Yeah, I, I, like, I like the Kasplats too. <laughs> DK64 just has great sound effects in general. Queen, oh, Queen Station is the fungus area. Yeah, that probably would have been faster. Oh well. Guess we're going the long way then. Maybe we can get some extra geo along the way. Yep. Whoa, 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 I hope talk on I love the money magnet. Even if it doesn't work 100% sometimes. It's still very good. I did. Oh, we're actually... Okay, it was, it's not that long of a walk to the fungal wastes. I probably am going to the wrong entrance compared to where I should be going. But that's okay. You can comment on whatever videos that you want. But if you comment on old videos, I'm probably not going to be responding to them. Like, again, you can comment on whatever you want. That's perfectly fine. But let's be honest, a lot of my old videos are not very good. <laughs> I f I, in some ways, I feel like my first real Let's Play was Harvest Moon 64. That was kind of a turning point in terms of the quality. That was the first video that that was the first video series that I actually like put time into editing. That was also I believe the last let's play I did where I edited the videos in Windows Movie Maker. Because boy howdy, there's nothing like doing intensive video editing in Windows Movie Maker to make you realize how bad Windows Movie Maker is. Alright. Wee bonk. Ouch. I got hit with a little gas. That's that shouldn't knock me around. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, twenty sixteen was the first year I started Let's Play Oof. Ow, I Oops, I did it again. <laughs> no. Dog Got it! Yeah. I just really want to take a bath. Oh, uh, I can't forget. Uh, I'm forgetting the controls. I forgot how to do the Super Grover dash. Really? That's. Wait, no! Oh. It looked... It looked like there was a secret passageway up there, but maybe I was wrong. Maybe I was wrong. Don't boil me alive, please. I don't taste good. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, I can't do anything about that. Did I do... No, I don't like Britney Spears. But the song was appropriate for the situation. Uh, yeah. 
I plan on those, because I clearly added them to my list of things that I wanted to play one day. Oh, hi! Hi! Uh, uh, bleh. Okay, we can't redirect them like it's uh, Ocarina of Time playing Tennis of Ganondorf. Oh, hi! I see how we go and do this. Maybe. Ah! Ouch. Okay. Not good. Ah! Okay. I don't like this. Well, I'm really glad the heal went off just in time. Killed him! Yes! Okay, whew! There we go! That was a close one. Who's my favorite singer? That's easy, me. No question. The Charm Notch. Honestly, um... Lead singer from Journey was really, really good voice unlike any other. That was a very close fight. I definitely almost died multiple times, but thankfully the heal went off just before I ran out of HP. I also forget if I put any money in the bank. Both in the game and in real life. Hmm. Wow! Oh, hi Owen Wilson! Please excuse me. Wow. 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 Alright, where have I been? What the heck? This is not a place I'm supposed to be in the Fuggus Woods. This doesn't appear on no map. Wow. 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 There are some great voice clips in this as well. <laughs> Did I already go for here? I did, oh, that, that loops around. I see. Hmm. Fascinating. Oh, that's right. This is the Mantis Village. Uh, yeah. Now it's coming back to me. It's been a week, so I haven't... I don't remember anything from the week that just went by. Obviously. Let's touch up. Ooh. Nice. New charms. That's fun. There are already so many charms of this that I can't equip that kind of wish I could up my BP like I can in Paper Mario, but alas, that just doesn't happen. Not yet, anyways. Although I guess you can buy the BP ups, but they're not as common. Let's see. Yeah, I, lo I love BP. <laughs> Ouch! When am I gonna learn how to swim in boiling water? Oh, wait. Something hit in there, but it's on the other side of a door. Curses! Maybe I can get to the other side. I can't go up and over. Oh, no. Oh, no! I ran out of dashes! Okay, I kind of thought that that was going to redirect it and hit it back like a tennis ball and not just immediately kill me. <laughs> that is impressive. Uh, you can only, What happened to my dashes? You can only dash once in midair before you touch the ground, and I wasted it. That's what happened. Well, guess we're going to Queen Station. <laughs> I do like bombs, but not in that context. 
Whee! Let's ride! Oh, that's actually not too far away. Grand! <laughs> I already went up that way. Don't really intend on going up again. <laughs> this way, Gromit. Oh, we... That was literally the way that I just said I didn't want to go up again. This is the right way. Alright, just go straight east. Until we find my shadow. Ooh. I'm pretty sure there's nothing up here. Or nothing up here that I haven't already gotten. Ouch! Really? I never got this? The hollow nest seal. Thanks! Uh, don't worry, I'll take good care of it. Bye! <laughs> this way. Yes, it was very different. And if you watch the video, you know why it was different. Oh, that's right. Okay, uh, I don't like how you're rapidly throwing bombs, actually. I don't like how the bombs are locking onto me, actually. What's this? The Wanderer's Journal that I can do nothing with. Yay! I hate how fast the screen scrolls down, so you get caught off guard easily. Do I literally? No. I don't have to go all the way around to go just below. Uh, I was taken... Have you not seen Star Wars Episode 3 Revenge of the Sith? That is definitely what the thumbnail was taken from. Whoa! Uh, Revenge of the Sith's a good movie. It's a it's a mimetic masterpiece. Oh, that's right. It's it's where the bouncy stuff is. I forgot about good old bouncy stuff. Let's see, is there anything else down here that I haven't explored yet? It's entirely possible. I also definitely need the extra will. <laughs> I definitely, I definitely need the extra will. But the, I... Even if I buy the thing from the shop, which is pretty expensive, by the way, I don't think it gives me enough to get a will upgrade. Okay, that was a great bounce. You gotta put your back into it. I think I've been here, but I don't know if there's something new that I can get here. Yeah. Okay, it would not let me wall jump up that. Cool. Sure, why not? Alright, well that's a little bit of a trek. That's okay. As Fire Emblem 6 taught, treks can be good. I feel like the wall jump does not work very well if you use it at the bottom of a wall. Alright, well, 
when we go back, we defeat our shadow. That's right, nothing over there. I feel like the quote-unquote pogo jump should send me higher, but it don't. But it don't. There was a bit of chocolate. Not a ton, though. I hate how you can't see where the freaking water is before it's too late and you've already hit it. Well, maybe 2DX Vision has other things to do tonight. Well, great. This is exactly where I want to be. About to die in the exact same place. That was well-timed. <laughs> Nicely done. That was well-timed. But doggone it. This is not going my way tonight. Watch there not even be anything new over there that I haven't gotten. Everybody who's like, knows this game inside and out and has watched my stuff is like, Artie, there's nothing there. Don't you remember? It was dead end. It's like, well, no, I don't remember, as a matter of fact. Because I have a goldfish brain. I have excellent memory for things that I've experienced over and over again, but not things that I'm experiencing for the first time. Did he just use a flamethrower on me? There we go. Wait, you- oh, you can! Interesting. Thanks for the tip. But honestly, even if I had known that, I wouldn't have. Because <laughs> I am extremely stubborn and suspicious. I don't like the bouncy platforms. They seem very temperamental. Like, sometimes they work and sometimes they don't. Okay, yeah, I already went over there. Dog on it. Like, I just swung horizontally. I didn't even hit any part of the bouncy platform, and it's just like, you want to go all the way off a cliff? Here you go. Alright, this is new. Spore Shroom. Oh, are we playing Plants vs. Zombies now? Alright, I guess there was one new thing. Nobody requested the splat sound effect. I added it myself. Uh, boop. Yes, yeah, Super Grover makes his triumphant return. That might be my favorite uh, upgrade in the game. That I found thus far. Oh! And where else could I go? How about up here? This definitely seems familiar. 
But at least there's free money. Hold up, you can't just be like, hey, there's a secret passage here, and not, not have it actually lead anywhere. There's gotta be something special in there. Wow, there really is just nothing? That feels like a waste. Hmm, interesting. Yoinks! Plants vs. Zombies is awesome, it's the best mobile game ever. I know it's technically not only a mobile game, but I feel like it was definitely designed to be played on mobile. Alright. Junk! There we go. Actually, wait. Nope! Stupid remote control bombs. Oh, oh, that's it. Actually, there is a way up here that leads apparently to a dead end that I have a hunch I can go through now. Now that I have Super Grover's cape. The map is nice. Being able to see where you are on the map is pretty nice. When I'm not familiar with the map layout at all. Oh, that's right. I remember this area. Uh, no! Yeah, like, the wall jump just does not work on shorter walls like that. At all. Even though I stick to them. There's a socket in his chest. Insert the city crest? I don't even know what the city crest... where I got it from, but okay. Oh no. Dead guy. That's the shopkeeper, isn't it? Sure looked like the shop she keep her. What the heck? How was I supposed to know that would happen? That he would explode like that? I hope there's a bench around here. Oh great, no map for the area. Oh great, guy with a sword. How did my downward swipe not hit him, but his horizontal swipe hit me when I was above him? Really? How am I supposed to know which enemy- Okay, I'm cool if respawning here. Even though there's no bench. Where's my sh there's my shadow. I hate how the explosions can just come out of nowhere and that they damage two instead of one. Alright. This is an ominous tunnel with no music. Oh, now here comes the music. Alright, those guys I'm getting the hang of now. I think I'm getting there. Ooh! Now it's raining, for some reason. It's not raining anywhere else in the world. Okay, they're very weak to the pogo hops if you can do them properly.
Nothing. There we go. Whoop. What does it say? The great gates have been sealed. None shall enter and none shall leave. We'll see about that. Oh, there were spikes. Going down. Hey, dude, I want to sit here, too. Can we be bench buddies? He's like, yes, I guess. Cool. Thanks. The capital lies before us, my friend. What a somber place it seems, and one that holds the answers to many a mystery. I, too, have begun to f uh, feel the pull of this place. Though now I sit before it, I f I can't read. Though now I sit before it, I find myself hesitant to descend. Is it fear, I wonder, or something else that holds me back? Bench buddies. Everybody needs a bench buddy. Give me a break, I've had a long day. Okay, that... There was no way that hit me. I was, like, a mile above him. There we go. Nothing to examine? Oh, no, that, never mind. That has money in it. I like money. I like this. Ooh, City of Tears, aka Rain. I feel like those guys are easier than their ground counterparts. Oh, I saw my ex-wife's eyes. Gotta go back to it later. I guess I've killed enough monsters now that my ex-wife will be like, Good! Thank you for bringing me the souls that I wanted. Here. Have a, have a gift card to Carabas. Hollowness seal. Ouch. Excuse me. Look, you haven't met my ex-wife. Do you think the rain is actually God's tears? Uh, no. I think God controls the rain but I don't think it's, like, God crying and then it rains on Earth. <laughs> hey, hey, Mobius. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> if you want the Karabas gift card, you'll have to talk to my ex-wife. place is beautiful. Why do I not have a map for this area? I can make one! I have a piece of paper, right? Hey, 2DX Vision, welcome. Hey, no worries. You ran out of cat food. That takes priority over already streaming Hollow Knight. You gotta keep the kitties happy. Don't worry, no one was making a list and checking it twice. To wonder if you were impish or admirable. Okay, the, are, the hitboxes on these guys are so messed up. Like, they can hit you when you're... They can swing horizontally and hit you when you're literally above them. That one was on me. Did you just yell, Grandma? <laughs> Sounded like it. Oh, you can throw javelins at me. Just like Grandma. Is that a grub, or is it that little bush guy again?
Grandma, I will avenge you. Thank you. Yes, he is. Ow. Get out of here, you stupid beetle. Now, oh, what? Well, nothing. You were just hanging out doing nothing? I thought you were guarding something valuable. Oh, no! It's the guy that just kills you. <laughs> Got a little stuck there. How delightful. Artie's always looking for new sound alerts. I wish I had a map, because so often I'll be like, I'll come back to this area later, and then I don't. Oh no, it's locking me out. Oof. Grandma! Grandma, do you not have cat food either? Are you a real grub or... Okay, good. Because now I'm paranoid. Now every time I see a grub, it's like, are you actually going to be real? Or are you going to try to kill me? Ooh. Yeah, you got to... Oh, Hi! I just wanted to say hi. Okay. We're gonna play hardball, eh? Wow! That guy means business. It's okay, I had my bench buddy. Oh yeah, I don't have a map for the area, so I'm not gonna be able to find that again. Great! Curse you, you stupid hitboxes! No, no, no! I know this is not where I went last time, but maybe it leads somewhere cool. Maybe it'll lead to the map guy. Ah, yes, Cornifer. Now it feels like this is definitely back in the Fungus Woods area. But it still says I have no map, so we're technically still in the new area. Now this is definitely Fungus Woods. Or Fungus Wastes. Ooh, this definitely looks trustworthy. Not creepy at all. Have you brought me another nail to be honed? Leave it on the ground and return later if you're still breathing. Mm? Uh, oh, I thought you were someone else. Ah, uh, after a nail smith, are you? Well, you found one. I'm not much for talk. But if it's a nail that needs repair, then you've come into the right bug. Your own nail is in quite a sorry state. It's obviously not one of mine. Still, anything can be refined with enough effort and skill, even that broken blade. If you'd like, I can reforge your nail. It'll make the blade far more deadly. I would love to, but I don't have enough. Ah, you don't have the geo? Come and see me when you do. Well, I'm definitely doing that. Definitely. Which is better, Zootopia or Moana? Zootopia or Moana? I definitely like Moana. The cows are the best in that. But in all... In seriousness, I like Zootopia more. Moana was... I only saw Moana once, and I watched it, and I'm like, that was good. And I've literally never had the desire to go back and watch Moana again. It wasn't bad, it just didn't leave much of an impact on me. I 
I do not know why people like the shiny guy, like, so much. It's it's not a cult that follows him, but, like, I'm like, he was, like, a random one-off character. Why do people seem to think he's, like, the best part of the movie? Oh, I can be in this water, but not in the other water. Alright, I gotta make sure I survive so I can get my stuff back. Those guys would not be nearly as scary if their hitboxes were proper. In the, in the middle of the new Dune movie, interesting. A mechanism with a simple keyhole. Oh no, I wasted my simple key! Okay, that's the wrong way. Gotta buy another simple key then. Cool, going down. Actually, wait, can we go up again? I said going up! Nope, we can't go back up. Rats. I bought the- f I already bought the simple key, I just used it on the simple door that was right next to the shop. And it led to somewhere not so great. Oh, wait a second, if worse comes to worst, I can go back there and, like, have that guy bring my stuff back. Because I think that's what he does. not want to die here. You flew down a little lower than I expected. Hmm. <laughs> here are getting tough. Wait, uh. Nope. Nope! <laughs> this better be good. It's a rancid egg! That's it! There's a bench up this way. Just have to hope I don't get ambushed along the way. I got ambushed along the way, literally. Wow! These stupid signs are like, bench this way, are you on 1 HP? Oh, just, just get the bench, just go this way, it's fine. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> stupid! You lost all your money. What, did you actually think there was a bench that way? No, we lied. If they wanted you to know that was a boss room, then they should have had a sign saying, Hey, boss this way, and not, Hey, you can get your HP back if you go this way. So, that's not on me. That's on the game right there. I also love how they never let you get to the map guy until you're at a point where you've already, like, 
export. Like, long after the point where you actually would need the map. Just peak design. But that was the first time I actually lost it for good. And again, I 100% blame the game on that, because they literally lied to me and said that there was a bench that way. And don't give me that, well, if you beat the boss, it's a bench. Like, no, if you say there's a bench that way, there better be a bench right the heck that way. Because there's not a bench that way right now. There might be in the future, but not right now. So what, was, what were the people making the sign for? Aye, aye. I'm searching for rare items, have you? Well, hands off! This collection is mine, and I won't be selling to grubby little wanderers. Still, I imagine you may come across many interesting items in your travels. Perhaps you'd care to part with some. I'll offer a fair trade for each. Wanderers' journals. So I can sell these? Oh! That's interesting. I'm not going to, because I might need them for something else. Maybe the bugs started living in the room after the sign was made. Eh, I don't know about that one. Honestly, I think the game is mainly just frustrating because I've had a bit of a long day. It's still very fun. But that, that kind of ticked me off a bit. It would have ticked me off more if I had more money. I actually don't know how much money I lost. Tomoyo After is a spin-off of Clonad, a visual novel that I played and enjoyed. Grandma! Why do I still hear the grub? Didn't I save the grub? I hope nobody wanted those chandeliers or anything. Because they're definitely not getting them anymore! That's right. That door is still locked. Well, I have more than one HP and actually know what's coming this time. Stupid grandma. Why does everything blow up so easily? <laughs> exactly. Oh no. Is it my imagination, or is my nail getting shorter, uh, has shorter range than it used to? Oh, no, just kidding, man. The, uh, the, the bench is actually up here. Super promise. Why do I not believe... Press X to doubt. A toll machine with the symbol of a bench. Wow, that was like a double lie. <laughs> First there wasn't a bench, and then there was, but you had to pay for it. And hey, it's this dude. 
Isn't this a change from those twisty natural caverns? The rain does, does cast something of a sadness upon it all, but the architecture is simply splendid. Charting such a different space is quite the challenge, though one I've eagerly undertaken. Perhaps you'd like to purchase a copy of my achievements so far. Sure. I wish you could have given me that, I don't know, at the beginning, and not when I've already probably explored most of it, but oh well. Still out a couple hundred bucks, but what you gonna do? <laughs> yeah, why does everything explode so easily? That could be a sound alert. <laughs> Oi, watch where you're going, you soggy vagabond! I don't want you splashing me. I've had a miserable time trying to keep dry. I am Zolt the Mighty, a knight of great renown. If I decide that I'm going to stay dry, then that's what's going to happen. Curse this wretched day! Water and monsters constantly fall from above. It's no wonder this blasted kingdom fell to ruin. Happy Easter to you, too. What? <laughs> Grandma! You did that to yourself. Okay, don't fall on those spikes. Or those spikes. Have I been this way before? I can't remember. Oh yeah, I have. It's a shortcut. Those still exist. Marsh marshmallows are frequently pretty friendly. Oh. I know what to do with that. Ouch! That was a mistake. Ouch! That was rude of you. It really does feel like my sword has less range than it did at the beginning of the game. Marty, what's up? Yeah, that's that's probably the case. It's just it's all a matter of perspective. Well, I've been fighting bugs for the whole game. It's just now these are flying bugs. Flying bugs that have abnormally long weapons. Take that. Oh, there we go. I think we got them all. Oh my gosh! I didn't even have to pay for the simple key. I just got one. For being... Well... I was gonna say for being good, but I haven't been that good. I have not been playing very well. <laughs> yeah, I had a bit of a... Marty, I'll give you an idea. The first thing I did when I got home from work, I took a bath. Not a shower! A bath, 
and change into my pajamas. It was just one of those days. Nothing like being forced to stay an hour late at work so you can attend a stupid meeting that you shouldn't have to be attend that goes on for too long. Subway station! Let me guess, I don't have enough Geo to open it up. Correct, I don't have enough Geo to open it up. Why am I not surprised? They're like, what? Wait, 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 wait. You actually, you lost your money? Are you stupid? You don't deserve to be able to buy anything then. It's like, I lost all my money because the game blatantly told a lie to me. Well, that's not our fault. Kinda is. <sighs> Oh, that dude's hiding something. Hey! You can't do that. Another Wanderer's Journal, eh? I did, but I don't want to sell key items. I might need them later. Like, if I was able to sell the, the rancid eggs, then maybe... Why does everything cost money? Back in my day, when we played video games, we got stuff for free. You saw me playing Paper Mario. The Toad let me sleep in his house for free. Now I gotta pay for it? If you don't want me falling asleep during meetings, then make the meetings actually productive and relate to me. If you force me to attend a two-hour meeting where people spend the entire two hours talking about nothing, then expect me to be kind of annoyed. Especially when you ask me to stay at work late for it. That's the double whammy. Yep, that do be how it be sometimes. Oh wait, I have enough to activate the lift now. I don't like these enemies. They just fly away from you, so you can't hit them. Where would we be without the Geomagnet? It's like, Artie, you have all these cool badges you could equip. I'm like, I want Money Magnet, and I want my face on a compass. I'm not really in a worse mood, I'm just more prone to getting frustrated, I guess. It's understandable. This better take me somewhere good. Ooh, yes! That will be fun. Oh, is this where I think it is? Oh, yeah! You all remember this. That's... Dang, I get you. Mm. I get you. So that's where we went. Now we just gotta collect some money. Actually, no, we don't. We got more to explore in that area. I do love me some shortcuts.
I would love to get to that subway station, but you flatter me, but no. That is not true. This, man, this might be an absolutely enormous world. Think I should go left? I think I should go to the bench, personally. Yeah, I heard you got the new job, Marty. Congrats. It's gonna be exciting. See, I could go to the fungal waste. Nope, I'm not going to the fungal waste. Yes, this way looks good. Yeah, remember this guy? Okay, that's just not fair. Every oh, he had way less HP than I thought he did. Oh, wow, I just saw my ex-wife's eyes again. I really should go back to my ex-wife's eyes. Ooh, the soul sanctum. Any song that opens up with a powerful organ playing, I'm down for it. Is somebody humming the Luigi's Mansion theme song? It sounds like somebody's humming the Luigi's Mansion theme song. That probably needs a simple key. Oh, no, no, no. Some kind of key, but not a simple one. That's a scary looking door. do this, right? Fine. I bet you you can do that if you're really good. Well, that sounds like the Luigi Mansion theme song. Fine, I didn't want to take the elevator anyways. Yeah, I'm sure you can do that if you're a speedrunner. There was a wall crack. Nah. Besides, I'm exploring the Temple of Time. Oh, this guy's just a common enemy? This guy screamed he was a boss. So no, no, it's just a common enemy can teleport now. Sure. Okay, this is officially my favorite song of the game. I'll figure it out. I'll be re-exploring these areas eventually. Ooh, record ABBA. The mind still limits us so. How to break past its constraints? To attain a pure focus, is it even possible? You know, Marty, I might play Dora Super Spies if somebody hadn't sold it. Shots fired.
Oh, hey. Hey, dude, I don't really want any trouble. Of course you don't get any opportunities to heal. Why would you? No spoilers on what my next Let's Play is. You will get to be surprised. Must say, I'm not a fan of these new enemies that I'm facing. They seem basically like bosses in Mook's clothing. Okay. Oh, I'm closer than I thought. Oh, that's right. I'm not at my bench buddy's seat anymore. Marty, only one person knows who my next Let's Play is, and that's Jesus. Like, even I don't know what my next Let's Play is. I have a plan on my next Let's Play, but if, like, God speaks to me and it's like, Artie, you will not upload your next Let's Play. Instead, you will play Pac-Man World 2. I'm like, okay, I guess I'm playing Pac-Man World 2 then. <laughs> he gets final say. It's like, oh, sorry, I was gonna play Dora Super Spies, but then Jesus said no. You understand, right? Yeah, I don't like Mr. Teleporting McGee. This guy is definitely way too strong to be a common enemy. That guy is way too strong to be a common enemy! You have to hit him like 15 times. I do, too. I'm just not discounting it as a possibility. That's all I'm saying. Well, I got news for you. Even I don't know what I'm, up with, what I'm streaming after Pikmin 2. I play it by ear. Did I ever tell you guys that... I, there have actually been a couple of Let's Plays... That I, I flat out started recording, and I recorded several episodes, and then after a couple of episodes, I'm just like, No, you know what, I'm not Let's Playing this, and then I never uploaded any of them. There were some Let's Plays where I recorded partially, and I uploaded the partial episodes, like LEGO Star Wars 2 and Animal Crossing. But did y'all know that I had actually recorded, like, six episodes of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets for the GameCube? And was literally gonna make that a full Let's Play, and then just, I didn't. This guy is officially the worst enemy in the whole game. Thankfully, thankfully I abandoned it before I ever uploaded the first video, because I like recording my Let's Plays in advance. Okay. Can I, can I not be fighting these guys every two seconds, please? Wait, did I miss my shadow? It says my shadow is too far down. Ow! My butt! Why, why, why do these elevators have spikes on top of them? Okay, seriously? Where is the stupid shadow? I go up high and they're like, no, you went up too high. I went down lower, they're like, no, it's not here either. There he is. So, just the place on the map was completely 100% wrong. Talk on you! 
Stupid toad. Seriously, I would I would just love to know if there's actually a consistent way to beat teleporting McGee. Because it literally just feels like he's like, oh, he shoots stuff at you that homes in on you, and if you try to attack him, he just teleports away. You can give me a little tip, sure. Not for the toad guy that I just died to, because I, I keep entering the fight with like one HP. So I haven't really like experienced him. But if you want, if you want to give me some tips on the stupid teleporting spammy wizards that seem impossible to do consistently, then sure. Wow. Get back here. You don't need to go into the room with the teleporty guys. That was to reach a lever at the top. Oh. Doesn't doesn't give me. Okay, that that helps me bypass them. By the way, hi, Marty's Baker friend. Okay, let's try this again. This guy's got a frog face. Okay. I hate, I hate boss fights where you just don't have an opportunity to heal in the middle of them. Gee, thanks, Moby. That just really helps. Yes. I don't want the charm that makes me heal faster. I want the boss to actually allow me to heal at the regular speed if you can get the timing down. Ah, greetings, Beauregard! <laughs> How are you? We are having a very rough time of Homo Night tonight. plan, instead of healing, we're just going to summon our spirit. Alright, there we go. I feel like you should be dead by now. Man, this guy's got a lot of HP. No, I did not dash that way. Wow, that guy has a lot of HP. Good lord. Can't tell if the game's getting hard or if it's just I'm playing really badly because I'm keep dying in the same spot, so I keep rushing over to the same spot over and over again, and because I'm rushing, I'm making mistakes. I mean, it's definitely not an easy game. <laughs> yes. Artie and Marty are both colorful. Same last name. Alright. Well, 800th time is the charm.
get wrecked. Wow, I don't know how they'd expect that room to be possible. It's like, hey, what's better than one teleporting McGee? How about 800 of them? <laughs> Just ignoring that. Yeah, well, it's amazing what happens when I really concentrate. And have actually died a bunch to it, so I know its pattern. Okay, now how is that fair? He literally spawned where I jumped. I'm just ignoring the stupid teleport, you guys. They're more trouble than they're worth. Unless they appear right in front of me. Actually, even then, though. It's also because I rarely feel actually angry. Frustrated is a better word. Okay. For realsies? There are more enemies in the game than just teleporting McGee. Like, seriously, I think at this point, one of one teleporting McDoobie is more difficult than that boss I just fought and died a bunch to. Okay, sure, that's fair. Let's just throw ten teleport guys in the room. I don't need any calming tea. You guys are all wrong. The best artiest chartreuse. So, it's, oh, so that's the room that they just didn't play test at all. I see. I mean, Marty, I have my avatar's design heavily was inspired by D Blob. Because the idea that I had for my game starring Artie was heavily inspired by D Blob. I literally feel like even if you're in a perfect position to attack them, they're just like, okay, we'll just teleport away. Inspired by, not ripped off of. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, wait, I already went that way. I don't want to go that way. No. Oh, come off it! Wall jumps are a little finicky. Curses. Yeah, this just doesn't seem fair, or balanced, or fun.
it's a good thing that they've got gorgeous music in that area because that's the only thing that's really keeping me going back there. Well, to be fair, I never actually made the game, so... <laughs> and it would have been a very different kind of game. What is... D yeah, we... We, De Blob is a game for the Nintendo Wii. 3D platformer where you play as an ink blot that is painting the city. Alright, these guys should not have hit me that many times. Did he just shoot that through a wall? Yeah, look, look at this. He can just spawn right on top of you, damage you, then teleport away. So you can't even attack him. All that's missing is for them to just be insta-death. I guess it depends on how obscure you want to go. Because some people would consider Humongous Entertainment Games to be obscure. And if that's the case, then Fatty Bear's Birthday Surprise. How about wall jumping, you lunatic? Oh, wait, no, 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 I know. Rocket Slime. Rocket Slime. It's definitely gotta be a Rocket Slime. I am still very sad that Rocket Slime, technically free, never came out in uh, America. Look, it looked good. I had fun in the first half of the stream. Oh my gosh, I might actually be getting it. If you're in a corridor... Oh. Never mind. I'm playing on... I'm probably not supposed to be in this world yet. <laughs> but hey, I know people do, like, low percent runs of this game, so it is totally possible. Whew. 
Yeah, if I if I specifically ask for it, then you can tell me. Otherwise, no. How about a bench? How about a bench? I see that thing floating in the background. You can't fool me. Oh, great! Soul Master! Because the little teleporting McGee's weren't bad enough. Ah! You interrupted my very important heal. Oh, this is cool. Love the music here. Oh my gosh, this is the devil from Cuphead with that pattern. Oh, I see. Changing it up a bit, eh? I feel like this guy is easier than the little ones. Oh, I, I lucked out there. It's mine, boys. Mine for the taking. This guy's got a lot of HP. <laughs> wow, that guy was easier than the regular teleporting McGee. done yet. Doing so well, though. Oh, gone it. <laughs> he just didn't know I was above him.
Yeah, I can do it. Believe in yourself, that's the place to start. Just gotta go focus mode and stop talking. <laughs> I hit the lever in the in the hell room, yeah. Just feels like it, these rooms it's just like enemies can teleport on you and it's like, well, you took damage. Where is the Dane Frazzle Frazzin elevator? I thought it was way lower down than that. How was I supposed to get out of that? And of course, a freaking course it won't let me get my money back. It doesn't. Here's the thing people are like, you should upgrade your nail. I freaking couldn't because every time I got enough money, I died, had to go back to where I was. And by that point, I'm really far away from the guy who can upgrade my nail. So I really haven't been able to upgrade my nail, actually. Marty knows what that's from. No, I'm ge I'm beating that stupid boss. Besides, Marty, you haven't even played Hollow Knight before. Boyfriend's not allowed to give me unsolicited advice if he's played the game before. And that goes for everyone who's played the game before. It's blind playthrough. I do not want advice unless you haven't played it before. <laughs> or if I actually ask, hey, you know, I'd like some advice on this situation. Nothing against your boyfriend at all. No, it's just I want this to be a fresh experience. So I have to fight the phase one again? Great. Okay, phase one wasn't too bad. Okay. Curses. Doggone it, he did the worst move he could do. Looks like he really wants to beat me. Man, he loves this four fireball move. That was a close one.
no! Come off it! <sighs> he should have been dead by then. Fire Emblem 6 started off pretty easy, then got really, really stupidly hard, and then got really easy again. Honestly, though, that was my fault. See, that boss is actually perfectly fair. Unlike all of the enemies leading up to him. That was my own fault that I died to him. See, that, that boss is the, an exa a perfect example of good difficulty. He's hard, but he's hard for the right reasons. These guys are an example of fake difficulty. It's just like, well, there's nothing you can do, you just get your butt kicked. Have fun. Like, ser seriously, how can you possibly get through that without taking up copious amounts of damage? If they just decide, hey, we're going to hit you. And look, he's just, he's just sitting there. And he moves away from me if I get too close. No, you know what? If you're going to be cheap, I'm going to be cheap. I have zero problem using this strategy. Goodbye, love ducks. Goodbye. Come off it. Those guys have big hitboxes. I'm not super eager to give Shadow Dragon a spin. It seems like it's a little primitive for Fire Emblem. Alright, let's try this out again. This has to be my final attempt of the Soul Master before I end the stream. Because we have been going pretty late. Oh, Alright, he is really hyper-aggressive with that slam attack. I hate how he can fake you out with that slam. The fake out move is kind of on the unfair side.
How is he still not dead? I feel like he has way more HP this time than he did the first time I beat him. There we go. damage off him that way, but the problem is there's no real chance to heal in this phase. Is he finally dead for realsies? Yeah, you don't come back from that. <laughs> Got him. Feel that power. I fought it as a consumed desolate Dave. Desolate Dive. Tap A while holding down to strike the earth with a burst of power. Oh, you know what's the most well, there we go. Exciting thing about winning when you win. I love that feeling. So now we find. Wait. Oh. I forgot I had a charge shot. Wait, hang on. Am I doing this wrong? Wait, it said. That is, um... How did I do that? How did I do that? I can't do that attack again. What the heck? I mean, the charge shot wouldn't have even been that good. What the heck? It won't let me do the attack anymore. Oh, you need soul for it. Oh, that was weird. That's weird. Okay, where's the nearest mother flipping bench? Don't flip mothers. It's, it's not nice. They don't often like being turned upside down. Wait... This is that Tower of Heck. Or is it? What the heck? There's rough with these guys. Is there no lever to open it up? Is this not the Tower of Heck? No, that's not suggestive at all. There we go. Well, now we can forge our nail. Is there, a, like, anything else maybe here in the tower? At all? Excuse me. You can't just send me here to the middle of nowhere and then not have anything to do. Can't even go. Wow! No, I mean flip them as in flipping them upside down. Black wits. Okay, well we can't go back the way we came, so there has to be something around here that we can use. There we go. Oh, that's what that soul attack is for. Hacha! Okay, that's pretty cool. Give me that. Hollow Nest Seal, thank you. Ew. 
These are the ghosts of all the guys who tried to fight the boss and failed. It's very morbid. Alright, we are getting dangerously close to death, so we better use up some of this. Didn't look like there was anywhere else to go down here, though. Oh, oh, that cracks. I saw that. I haven't really raged at this. I've just gotten annoyed. And the answer is none of those. The answer is bear storming. Always bear storming. Man, that game is getting exceedingly stingy with their benches. Good lord. It's like there's one bench in the whole world now. Yeah, I want to I want to end the stream, but the game's not giving me any benches. And it's like, "Oh, there's a bench nearby." No, actually there's not because there're all these walls in the way. Good night, Mobius. This means I'm now fat enough to go for the mine, though, so that's nice. Oh no, we're not supposed to be here. You better believe we're not ending the stream before we can find a bench. No heckin' way. Oh, are you having cake? As a matter of fact, I will be having cake. I got to take home an entire Easter cake. Because apparently my parents and older brother didn't want any. So I'm like, all right, I'll take the whole, I'll take the whole cake home. So yeah, after this, I will be tucking into a slice. I'm not even gonna bother with you. Not even gonna let you risk doing that. At last, a chair! Oh, thank goodness. Yes, Marty, it was the bunny cake. You missed out. All right. Well, I'm, I'm done with this for tonight. Good lord, that was. Kind of utterly ridiculous, but we did it. I I did it. Next time we will forge our nail and we'll explore more stuff. Thank you all for watching.